James Blackwood and Catherine Blackwood both died the same year, even though Mrs. Blackwood was supposedly murdered by uh, her, you know? Okay, so, whose coffin is this one? Guess what we're about to do. I seriously concerned what I was about to do, but my curiosity got the better of me. Fucking hell, I had to stop playing when I saw this, seriously. I just, like, I turned it off and I stopped playing it. It was just too friggin' nerve-wracking. A corpse in advance age's decomposition lit was inside the coffin. It was... disgusting. Come up with this top one. <sighs> what on earth? Curiously enough, this coffin was completely empty. Actually, if that's Mrs. Blackwood, and that should be Mr. Blackwood, they're both dead, where on earth is his body? Hmm. Curious. Very curious. Okay, we go down here. It's too dark to see here, and apparently Michael doesn't want to waste his goddamn matches here. And he doesn't want to open up anymore, except here's one that's a... Uh, there's a dead cat in there, yeah. And here's a tiny little Benny Betty coffin. I mean, really? Really? The prospect of witnessing the decaying body of a baby was, wasn't was very tempting. Yeah, this is the, um... This is obviously the, uh... Coffin to... James Blackwood's unborn child. But it's too dark to read. That drives me crazy. It's so weird how you get this to work here, and it's just so... Yeah, just watch. What I needed to do was... Uh... Um... Is it even here you get it? Actually, probably not. Mm, I don't think it is. Uh, what we need right is a stone. Okay, we're supposed to chuck up a stone to the window. Oh wait, hold on. There we go. But it's weird because obviously if it's it'd be really hard to find it because obviously you go down here and ask you to go down, but then you go down slightly lower and there's the hand grabbing something and then picks up. So yeah, that was really weird. Okay, so we take the stone and he fails because he can't throw. And there it is there, so we pick it back up again. And try again, again. <laughs> there we go. And there's the reflecting off that. And it also reflects down here onto this one. At least I think it's this one. So here's what we gotta do here. We take the wire that we got from the door and put it on the mirror. Now we have a wired mirror. And, uh... Is it this one we fell onto? Actually, I think it's a top one, isn't it? I don't know, it's really weird how this is all friggin' laid out, don't you think? Yeah. Now we can see. Imagine trying to figure that out by yourself, really. Anyway, uh... Mm, we can't see his name, but it begins with the letter R. Well, that was helpful. And actually, well, it is and it isn't helpful because... There's something you have to figure out. Which is... Borderline impossible, really. I stopped to think for a few seconds. I only found one body inside, and there were two plagues. Something was evidently out of place here. 
Yes, there was. Where was the second body? There's something, uh, there's something we have to go check the now. Uh, I should have done this when going out the front in the first place, but I forgot, so bear with me. Front to the mailbox. Oh god, I just called that a mailbox, didn't I? Why am I a fucking American? Jesus. Fuck me. Right, and there was nothing in the post box, so we uh, got to go back in. Because that evidently was not where we were supposed to be going. We still have a key though. I wonder why. Use that crowbar for something too, but what do we use it for again? Um, still got a newspaper. Still have that key as well, actually. Still got all these keys. Wait a minute. Alright, oh, yeah, that's the Blackwood key. I thought he discarded the keys as soon as he used them. Right, hold on. Let's um let's try going to the greenhouse I told you about. Right, it's actually really hard to find the uh, crypt. Oh, actually, I was about to say it's really hard to find the chapel, but no, that was it there. Right, and it's locked by a very special key that we won't be getting for an, a while. Yeah, that that crypt is like the point of no return, if you will. It's where it's where the final boss is, basically, if for lack of a better term. Right now, here, yeah. Do some serious rusting. Ah, I can get in here. Ah, I thought we needed a key, but yeah, hey, wait a minute. Those did you see that there? By the way, the glass was all friggin' broken, but I think Miss Remy was entered the boot house. It was, well, it was long and dried plants in the air. Yeah. Right, there's a couple of things to do here. Go here, there's a friggin' tap there. Doesn't work. Right, and uh, is it round here, I think? Ah, uh, oh, fuck me. I keep forgetting these little things, guys. Sorry. I'm gonna have to go back in the house for a bit. We gotta go into these dark bushes here to be brought here. The pictures are kind of inconsistent with each other at little times, you know. It's not game breaking or nothing, but it can be quite annoying. Uh, right, we've got to go back down to uh, the basement. I'm sorry, guys. I hate going to the basement and all. I see that piano thing that just went on there. That gets me every time. This is another one of these things that I would have. It would have been impossible for me to figure it by myself, you know. Right, we gotta look here. I haven't showed you this sort of shot here yet. There's a drain covering the concrete that. Which implies that there's sewers down there, but the vault won't budge and we can't oil it. So what we gotta do is the crowbar there and then take the hammer. He's carrying a whole toolbox in these fucking pockets. And we might need that crowbar later. So yeah, we got to turn we turned the um valve for a bit and uh if we 
go here. Let me check the sink, the incredibly manky looking sink. The water was running, but there seemed to be a problem with the pipe. So yeah, the water is now running, so that uh, pipe in the greenhouse will now function. And yeah, it, it was painfully obvious, I've just realised it was painfully obvious when I got into the greenhouse, but I didn't even talk about it. I'll talk about it when I get there. <laughs> See, you know, that's, that's what you do when you're playing games like uh, this, you know, you're... Uh, that's what happens when you're playing games like this, you know, point-click games that you got to do it step by step. You kind of get ahead of yourself and you think things that, you know, oh, I can do this and I'll get it done. But then you're like, oh, wait, I had to go back and do that first. Fuck! And that's pretty much what leads a lot to people getting stuck in these things. And I've actually been recording for so long today, my throat is starting to hurt. Nice. That glass is broken in the friggin' image, but that image is... So yeah, you guys probably noticed this. Some kind of shiny object beneath the grating. Uh, right. What we do here is... Uh... Okay, what we want to do now is... But there's a little problem. The water's going around here, but... These bushes are stopping the uh, water, so it's currently blocking the drain. The upper hallway was livelier than below due to several plants that somehow managed to sustain on it. Right, and there's a hose. Put the hose down there. And we take the hose. So now it goes into that bit of dirt. Yeah, this okay, I forgot to click on it there to show you guys, right? But Michael couldn't pull out that spade because it was stuck in the dirt. I'm serious, that's what it says. It was stuck in the dirt so he couldn't pull it out. Michael's pretty weak, but now that there's water in there, it softens it up and now he can pull it out, so that's why I had to do that. But yeah, Michael is weak. Very weak. Right. Okay, what do we have here? Bug spray. Uh, this is important, actually. This plant on the table is strangely attractive, and there should be... Shears. Ooh, letter. Okay, now what this talks about is, um, it talks a little bit about that plant. Does it talk about that plant? No, I don't think this particular one does. Oh, this is just I'm talking about abandoning the, uh, trios. Okay, um, I don't think we've come across the particular, like, uh, thing that tells you it is important, but yeah, this, uh, this plant is important. I'll just tell you right now, it's from Africa. So, and I need some leaves off it. So that's all I'm gonna say for now. Now, I didn't even know that when I was first playing it, but still, obviously, I used the shears on it anyway just to see what would happen, and sure enough, uh, Michael uh, goes and, uh, yeah. Okay. Now, this was weird last time I played it, right? First, I'm gonna take that off, and now I go over here and uh, I, cut the I cut these leaves so it doesn't block the tr drain anymore. Alright, check this out. It's gone. Right. Where's it gone to, I wonder? Well, there was another area I have yet to show you guys around here. And I'm about to tell you where it's showed up at. If I can find it. Because <laughs> that may be a bit hard. 